Everyone, what's up? Welcome to Cat Clash, I guess. Um, so, Cat Clash is a, I guess, a community driven um, clash that was created. Uh, it's, a, it's a new one, obviously. Um, but yeah, it's. Uh, The combos are kind of yeah. Let's see. So I think if I go here, yeah. So uh, I don't help us either. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to show the damn combos. This thing still doesn't work. So, anyways, um, let's see. Here we have. God, it's hard. Uh, so there's a lot of animal. Uh, they wrecked the shit, huh? Let's do this. Well, anyways, all right. So there's some archer animal. There's a bunch of random. Furry bullock is in this, which is probably the most common deal. Um, again, it's it's clash, so PCs are kind of king, and they had that run on on furry bullock uh, not too long ago. Um, for his PCs and all that kind of stuff. So if you bought those, you're basically going to probably do okay for this one. Um, I'm not running that just because I don't know. I, I don't know if it's, I don't, I don't care. I just don't like the combos in this, this clash. So I'm just doing more of what I want. Um, I'm running a, uh, uh, let's see. So I should show the combos. This doesn't just, have, yeah. Um, Duke, <laughs> which is Peggy. It's jab, gas, sturdy. I don't have any CM on that, so kind of boo on that. Um, Farnsworth cat with Farnsworth. Uh, so CM3 on that. Um, which jab, hijack, craze. Um, that's the craze option I have for here. Then I have Lila also for cats, which is cripple all. So that's really the only deal there and then for PCs I'm just filling in with uh, these DVLs so the reality of this clash is too is that um, <laughs> this arena is a lot of PK right now and 1940s and stuff like that obviously too so there, there's a lot of things that are just able to kill me straight up I don't have the PCs really for it because a bit older stuff um, the combos aren't that great anyways, so I don't really have a strategy, I guess, too much. Because there's so many things that could just take me out, right? So I'm not, I'm not sure, I'm not sure how far this is going to go. So we're just playing something that I think made the most sense to me at least. Um, but yeah, I really don't expect this to go well. <laughs> um, so yeah. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it though. Oh, the ratios on that deck. Uh, let's see. So it was I actually look here uh, Let's see what was it it was the Four of the farms worth three of the Peggy's and three of the Leela's so um, I guess heavy heavier on the craze side of things, but Again, it just it doesn't matter <laughs> Something's gonna kick my ass quickly. So Let's just get it over with. I mean, I don't know what that's gonna be. Yeesh. She's the strongest thing, I guess. Uh, seven. Yeah, barely, I guess. Uh, I guess this is probably best to have options. All right, so it's that. Um, I just go with this then. Okay, I guess I've seen five on her. <laughs> I never get to play this combo. It's that kind of age at this point. So <laughs> seeing CM five on it is kind of interesting because I didn't even know I had CM five on that. It was like CM four or something or three. I don't know.
lot of people playing Clone Brothers right now. I'll try this out, I guess. Oh, I'm not gonna get to play it. <laughs> I guess the values are good to see that at least. There's no CM, so the values are kind of weak. I'm not even sure how much. That combo was kind of like a late addition. I, I, I really just had a split of 5-5 five, five, uh, uh, Leela and Farns before. But I kind of went with this because I wanted this scenario actually here. I wanted to be able to do something about OMB, the jab and the gas. I figured it's probably the best option at least. I, mean, <clears throat> I don't know really. It's gonna be Bob and Steam, so just didn't get a good draw. Fortunately, oh, now we get it. Good figures. Where were you a second ago? Almost any loss on day one knocks you out of it, and I had two, so. Not like I was optimistic anyways, but that's a fate sealer right there. Quite a bit of people getting hundreds. Like I said, I'm not interested in this Clash. It's too, it's too much stuff I don't have, and Clash is PC really dependent. Um, Combos are gonna get harder once you start hitting the PK walls. So you start going to make a combo, you're gonna get walked by PK spam. So it's not gonna be fun. Um, so we'll just see what's next and hope for the best on that. Cause we 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 were 177 in the last melee, um, bigger melee. And this is gonna be trash. I already knew that going into it. So. I'm really just hoping the next thing is good is uh yeah i don't want to have to like get crazy in ecmc last time i last one was funny um i kept i was pushing for um uh turds because i wanted turds for this this bg to try to get some more inputs for 1940s so I was basically farming arena for it, but I was kind of pushing the ECMC at the same time, but kind of my group kept going, so I mean, he ended up with like, I stopped at like six something, and I think he went to like 12, like a million two, so <laughs> I don't know why I went that far, but you know, it's interesting. So. All right, well, Cat Clash Day 1 done, so 
We'll be back tomorrow for day two of this. Uh, until the end, once again, thanks for stopping by. With this video, please remember to get a like. Thanks.